for outdoor calculation you can go here insert exterior scene so you can simply insert exterior scene or you can load any dwg file as per requirement if you have the cad file and in, you can insert ground elements so let's say this is the outdoor element and i can put some standard element right uh, so i can put some you know buildings which are uh, big buildings let's say 8 by 8 and height is 25 meters high so in 3d you can see it very high so 25 divided into would be 12.5 the z axis coordinate so some outdoor buildings structures some vessels anything you can just put forward you can have some vertical cylinder which is can be you know again uh, 5 meter by 5 meter or 5 to 8 meter right you can just place it here it would be 4 meters right some cubes then you can put some uh, sport facilities like we can have some outdoor objects also some trees say some trees if you want to have it of height of let's say 10 meter high tree of height 5 meters right and then just you can copy this Eight meter would be fine. Five trees would be okay. So why it didn't happen? We can just go to exterior scene and see why it is like that. With a coordinate ten and five, so zero. So copy along a line. So you can have five. Let's you can have a length of 8 meters or 10 meters and just create a copy so it will be copied and just you can simply create a little high on this part and then you can just take a copy along a line sorry you can just click here cancel copy along a line so to the z5 would be 10 would be 5 so three dimensional it would be viewing like this uh, outdoor elements can be placed here and then you can add a high mast of 12 meter and add some lights for example to illuminate this particular area right what i can do is i have some buildings industry some office at this point right some office at this particular point right then you can have some sacred buildings, some church or something like that. Place it here. Right, and you can have a look how it three-dimensionally looks like. Right, so, so this is this is how we are placing this outdoor elements, right? And accordingly you can just have a lighting calculations also right so for outdoor here we have to use for facade lighting or area lighting depending on the requirement And rotate it here and can place it here so these are some arrangements where people can sit relax and enjoy outdoor facility okay. 
right uh, so you can see here the arrangements are being done so it has been little opposite so you can just update rotate it here you can just rotate it here you can just rotate it to uh, minus 90 maybe sorry zero Review how does it look? This is now changed, right? So that is we can do here also plus 90. This will be plus 90 plus 90. plus 90 right and then we can add some transport facilities also like traffic island and then what we can do we can put a high mast right so what we can do we can put an object uh, room elements, standard elements, uh, vertical cylinder at this particular point, maybe, which is maybe of height of uh, maybe 15 meter high, 7.5 meter. That is fine, and so this would be a high mast to illuminate this area, right? So then, what we'll do? We'll place some light fixture, flood light fixture. We'll go to file import luminar files you can see some light fixture here we can import some light fixture right so what is that light fixture we can see here technical data so 200 watt light fixture highway or flood light fixture so we can just go to the plan and we can just drag and drop it here this will be at 15 meter high so what we'll do, we'll keep this height fifteen meters. So fifteen meter it will be like this. We'll do some copy, some paste, some light fixtures. Control V Control V Control V Now we have to place the angle very suitably so What we will do is This looks like a light fixture But for the proper lighting fixture We would placing the angles in a very strategic way What we will do it Give it minus 25 degree right this one has minus 30 degree not minus 30 degree this would be 0 degree here this would got minus 30 degree here sorry 0 degree 30 degree right so the opposite of that would go as 30 degree Minus 30 degree thirty degree thirty degree zero degree thirty degree Degree. If you see, view and see this 3D distribution display, so you can see the light 
picture orientation so this has gone little opposite so we can just change it to minus 30 degree and then we can just have a look what is the line that we are getting at the bottom so this has gone little opposite also so this one has to be changed to plus 30 degree right and then what we can do is we can just have a look on the calculation surface let's say the calculation surface we put it here calculation surface I see we will keep it here how much light we are getting at this particular point right at uh, 0.3 maybe and let's run the calculations document is getting populated here so because of the exterior elements the time is taking a little more here so as you can see so this area is being populated by this lighting fixture because of this area and we can check the calculation what is the value that is being populated here we go to the output project to exterior scene 1 exterior surfaces ground element 1 task area 1 task area 1 value chart so you can see here uh, so the value we are getting is very good right so around uh, close to 39 lakhs for area illumination average of 55 lakhs area we are getting here and the main important part is the surrounding area illumination they will also give you a clean idea so this is the task area which you are seeing so this is the task area if you see here in the uh, first floor so this is a task area so in the task area so the main area of the task this is the light level and in this borderline what is the illumination that we are getting that we can get a very clear picture into this calculation and based on that we can you know just copy paste and populate another lighting surface at this point to check uh, what is uh, the area of the total part so what we can do is we can just go here just take a control C go to 2D and place it one here control V In 3D, you can just have a look. Take the light fixtures, Control C, copy, paste, and just click it here. Take it to this level. copy paste Let's take it here Copy, paste, copy. 
copy just paste it And go to the 3D view and change the alignments. Just run the calculation. So the list is getting populated. So you can check uh, the calculation out here in the exterior surface value chart so it would be better now this time because the improved two numbers of light fixtures are given so this is how basically we can just populate exterior scene surfaces and do the calculation surfaces for the areas